All right. Okay, Shalom. First and foremost, like give all praises. Honor and glory to Yahweh. Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakhakadash. Double honor to Apostle Elders, Great Millstone. And uh, peace and salutations to you, Sisei pushing this word in sincerity, truth, and charity. Brothers from uh, Great Millstone, Chicago. Lord willing, a, a quick and that fine um, in, in transit lesson, pretty much. Um, on We're just trying to come up with a topic. And, uh, you know, the brother driving, he, he's talking about um, we had to make a stop to get some um, something for his eyes, you know, like, uh, contacts drying up and stuff. So I was just thinking, man, how, I just told him, like, man, look, Lord going to give us our power back pretty much. Uh, the Lord stripped us from our power. He, he got curses put on us. That's why we get go through, have ailments, brothers can't see, they got wet glasses, you know, the animals. Most I had the fear of animals. The animals feared us at one time, but now anything we fear them, man. You know, in the kingdom of heaven, the scripture tell you that our children are gonna be playing with uh, with, uh with, like vipers, vipers aspers, and stuff like that. You can't do that now because the viper and ass will attack us because the Lord ultimately took the power away from us, man. You know, so we don't we don't have our power right now. Lord going to give it back to us. And that, um, I thought in the movie Thor, the scene of years ago, the very first one, how um, his father took the power away from him. And then at the end, he gave him his power back, man. You know, that's just like uh, what we're going through, man. The Lord stripped us from our power. He stripped us from the ruler seat. And now, the, um, I had scripture say, now we see uh, servants upon horses. Oh, right, right. Something like that. I, I forgot. I, go, I know it's Ecclesiastes. Yeah. Uh, like, you know, because, you know, the Lord, the Lord did, like, pretty much did a role, role reversal where the person, the, 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 the nation of people who have no business being in power, which is evident. See, look at, look at the state of the earth, man. These devils had no business being in power, but the Lord put them in power to punish us, pretty much, man. You know, so these devils, they, they, Lord gonna put them right where they belong as fucking servants, man. Real soon, man. Because they have no, it's evident that they, that you see what, how, how, the, how, how everything's going since they has been in power, man. Everything's upside down and backwards. Well, um, you got a scripture, bro? Yeah, uh, I got a couple of the ones you quoted. It is Ecclesiastes chapter 10, verse 7. I have seen servants upon horses. And princes walking as servants upon the earth. Yeah, so we at the bottom. Prince, see, princes, which hey, that's what Yasharala means. He is a prince of the power, man. You know, the most I made the earth for us to, to, to be in rulership, man. But it is not so right now. But you know, because you know, when we, we, we went off against Yahweh by Shimmy Al Shai. So the Lord punished us, he put curses on us. Now we have ailments, we don't have no power. Got ailments, brothers can't see. The guy got wet glasses. Brothers got high blood pressure, all types of the diseases, man. Brothers are going through, man. And we at the bottom, man. Your women don't respect you. All right, because let's be real, women respect power. That's the reason why you Israelite like men catch hell from the woman, cause you have no power, man. You at the bottom, and this is the reason why they wanna be. We saw Edom, and they respect him. They all humble when it come down to him. They humble in order when we come down to him, but when we come down to you, they out of order. And they giving you hell, man. Because we got curses on us, man. And we at the bottom. See, women respect power. That's why scripts say they should be willing to date our power. Oh, I got that. I'm holding that right now. Psalms 110, verse 3. Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power, in the beauties of holiness, from the womb of the morning, thou hast the dew of thy youth. Be willing to day by power, man. You know. So, so there you go. That's playing to the point, man. Right. Yeah. So, I got another one. Yeah. This is um, Isaiah chapter forty. I'll start at twenty-eight. As thou not known, as thou not heard, that the everlasting power Yahweh, the Creator of the ends of the earth, fainteth not, neither is weary. There is no searching of his understanding. Mm -hmm. He giveth power. 
to the faint and to them that have no might he increaseth strength even the youths shall faint and be weary and the young men shall utterly fall yeah that's what's going on now man you got fucking guys 20 years old with health problems man right <laughs> you know so hey man we, we fucked up here right now man we need deliverance man yeah. and that's what your house shot that's, his that's what his name means he is deliverer that's what he ultimately coming back to do deliver his elect starting with the elect because two thirds they they got to perish right along with Esau and other heathen nations but Lord willing we're part of that number starting with us that's what he's coming back to do deliver his elect and give us that power back man God, it's, okay from, from, oh, from verse 31 it says and it reads Isaiah 40 verse 31 but they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength they shall mount up with wings as eagles they shall run and not be weary and they shall walk and not faint you yeah. see so uh you know we're being returned to the lord you know we gotta seek him 10 times more all right and, and wait for his mercies man wait wait for his uh his salvation to, to his salvation to come to us man because what's included with that is uh that power that the elder is speaking of you see because we're nothing without yahweh bashim Shai. We're not going to trust in our flesh, you know, in a gun, and a sword. No, we're going to trust in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh He said, the Lord's the one that said that he's going to make us a new sharp threshing instrument having teeth. All right. He said, fear not, Jacob, thou worm. All right. The Lord got us. You see? And it's the Lord that's going to use us as his tool, as his instrument of destruction to fuck up these heathens, especially Esau, Edom, when the time comes. That's it, brother. No, because yeah, kind of scripture says uh, it's an easy thing to for the Lord uh, to increase a, 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 a brother's stature, man. So that, that's something small to the Lord, man, to to, to uh, make you grow, all right, uh, make you healthy. It says uh, it was neither uh, uh, modifying ointment, you know, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I got that. Let me get it. Yeah, then we get it. You mentioned something that's in Psalms 44. Hey, because even King David, he acknowledged you. How about shoot me out shot? And King David said, the Lord teaching my hands to war. So that go back to what the brother said, we're nothing. Wow, we all about shooting me off shot, man. You know, go ahead, brother. This is Wisdom of Solomon 16, verse 12. For it was neither herb nor mollifying plaster that restored them to health, but thy word, O Lord, which healeth all things. Right, so it's the word that, that heals all things, man. So the word is who? Yahweh Shai. And if he be with us, man, then hey, nothing can come against us, man. You know, and then it tells you uh, those that endure to the end, those, those same are gonna be saved. And it tells you uh, that uh, uh, that those men, same men that are endured, are gonna be changed in the twinkle of an eye, man. That mortal must put on immortality, right? The incorruptible must put uh, the corruptible must put incorruptible, right? So in the, in the twinkle of an eye, all right, the feeble is gonna be uh, changed to uh, uh, to their natural state, man. Cause you gotta remember, we we were uh, put in a, at a at a at a lower state, man. The scripture says those that came out of their first estate are reserved for chains of darkness, man. So right now we're on the chains of darkness, but our, our real first estate is to be gods, man. Yahushua said it. We are gods, but we should die like men. So uh, this is the book of Zechariah, chapter twelve, verse eight. And in that day shall the Lord defend the inhabitants of Jerusalem, and that and he that is feeble among them at that day should be as David and should and the house of David should be as the most high and as the angel of the Lord before them all right so the Lord's gonna renew our strength man we're not gonna be under the, these people of uh, subject subject to sin bodies you know uh, elements get uh, get infirmities you know and the reason why we're in this test is so we can, so we can endure the temptation the, the hell the, you know so we can go through the purification of, of what, what, what's it like to be purified to make made pure that's it man this is like a, it's a lesson most sides hey lord is a hard teacher man he wants you to experience stuff so you can under, understand man you know and that's why you know we're going to be the uh, perfect judges in kingdom because the lord is uh giving us the experience what the left hand is all about man you know so we can't be them, them them judges knowing both sides man we we gonna know when to have mercy on the heathens because they they still gonna be in the flesh man yeah you know because we gonna understand what they going through Cause we been through it man You know This is the whole purpose of the Lord doing all this Cause at the end of the day It was written that we gonna go th through all this It's part of the process 
to get to the kingdom of heaven. We had to be in these chains of darkness and go through all this that we're going through, man. You know, before the kingdom of heaven is established, man. Right. Just as the Lord, the Lord has mercy on us, you know, he knows that we're above flesh, man. That's why he has mercy upon us, man. Mm -hmm. You know, because we we, we're subject to sin, but, you know, and that's a lesson, and like the elder mentioned, well, that's a lesson for us, is that so that we, we rule the kingdom of heaven, we have the understanding between good and evil, man. We've got that discernment, you know, so that's why when the, when the nations go off, you know, we're going to rule them with a, hot, with a rod of iron, man, you know, because that, that's the blessing and the promise of the Heavenly Father, man, that, that, that we're going to have us rule over the nations, all right, and they're going to be subject unto us, man. Just like we're subject unto the first and foremost to the flesh right now, but unto these these uh, uh, vile, uh, base uh, heathens, man, you know, yeah. who, who are ruling over us. Yeah. See, the Lord is going to, uh, there's nothing to, for the Lord to make things right with these heathens are messed up, man. All right. You know, the Lord gonna start off with uh, that nuclear fire. It's evident that gotta happen to cleanse the earth because the earth is polluted. Hey, tell you Isaiah, the earth is when, them, when the Lord send them, put the spear on Russia and send them missiles on this place. It tells you in Isaiah 24 chapter, the earth is clean to solved. Mm. So it's, it's that, that's what that, that, that missile fire gonna do. Clean up things, man. C clean it up. Clean up this pollu 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 uh, pollution, man. All right. So yeah, man. You know, and, and, and um, we mentioned that movie Thor. I love that movie, the first one, man, because it's on point. Hey, when um, Thor's father took them powers away from him, I mean, he be like, man, I, Lord, I'm just a man now, man, and that's how we are now. You know, that, that man, me that scripture, um, you are gods, but you should die like men. Okay, oh, yeah. You know, because the Lord stripped us our pow power. Now we in this uh change the darkness it's flesh you know like you said, brother said you get sick you know you can die you get attacked by animals because like i said the most i put this the animals feared us at one point but then the lord gonna bring that back man you know, the animals gonna fear us again you know where well, we won't get attacked attacked by lions or bears and stuff like that man you know, the lord right. gives all that, that that power back man it starts with his wisdom and knowledge and understanding of the how about shimei shai that's it brother Cause that's because that's really a, a how things are operating man, through the wisdom of the Lord man it says wisdom moving through all things man you know that's why you got these like the brother mentioned you got these trainers dog trainers that are perfect with dogs you know even even they go as far as training lions and, and you know but that's because they that's the wisdom of the Lord man but we under these uh, we're in a low condition or low vibration we can't even fathom that type of uh, wisdom man to so able to control you know these different animals man you know, and even even at a lowest a lowest state, you know, Jay could be able to train a dog or whatever. But you know, in the kingdom, of Ray, it's gonna be automatic, man. That the complete fear, you know, everything's gonna be uh, in unison. Yeah, the Lord, you know. Yeah, the Lord gonna give us all the wisdom back, man. So, Everything, the Lord gonna give us give us all back, man. Once we done serving our punishment, the time we got to serve our punishment, man. Kind, of, yeah, and our punishment, you know. Is coming to a final end, you see? Alright? Because we're at the end of Esau Edom. It tells you in Lamentations, you know, that that hey our, our punishment is done. Now the Lord's gonna visit Esau Edom's iniquity, you see. But this is uh Job uh chapter five, you know, because we're we're coming into Jacob's trouble. And and even on this side, the Lord's gonna give us power, man. Uh Job chapter uh five. Uh, you know, I'll start up so we get the whole thing. Uh, this is verse 18. For he maketh sore and bindeth up, he woundeth, and his hands make whole. He shall deliver thee in six trouble. Yeah, in seven, there shall no evil touch thee. You know, Isaiah 54 and 17, no weapon formed against thee shall prosper. All right? We're going to be indestructible, man. We're going to be hunters soon, man, when the Lord increases us. All right? And gives us that green light. In famine he shall redeem thee from death, and in war from the power of the sword. Thou shalt be hid from the scourge of the tongue, neither thou shalt, shalt thou be afraid of destruction when it cometh. At destruction and famine thou shalt laugh, neither shalt thou be afraid of the beasts of the earth. You know, we were going into the, how the animals used to fear us. 
verse 23 there's a point for thou shalt be in league with the stones of the field so we're going to have control of the elements man spiritual powers once again and the beast of the field shall be at peace with thee and the animals all the beasts of the earth they're going to know who the elect are man all right and they're going to bow down like the brothers in holland when they went to the zoo that big gorilla saw who it was and then he bought the he bowed his head down to them i don't know if your brother saw that video but that was a good reference point god uh that was it on that yeah. this uh psalms 44 and 4 it said thou art my king O power the most high command deliverance for jacob mm. all right command and that's the only who the lord's going to deliver any damn way starting with the elect jacob which name was changed to israel Jacob had 12 sons. And that represents the nation of Israel. Consistent of you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. And speckled bird. Because you have our people looking like these other heathen nations as well. But their father's pedigree go back to either a so-called Negro, a so-called Latino, or so-called Native American. Alright? So it says, through thee, through who? Through Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, we will push down our enemies. Through thy name, oh, through thy name, you gotta have the actual names. We would trade and say script say uh, those uh, you know those who know the name, the, the names like strong tower, them to run to to it are safe. Yep. Alright. So you don't believe these guys tell me telling you that the name is not important, man. That we don't have the names. How the fuck do they say we go, Lord gonna return to us a pure language, but he ain't he not gonna give us our name. And he gave Mo he gave Moses his name. This is my name forever. Yeah, come on, man. This says um, through thee will we push down our enemies. But hey, they the nece they the necessary evil of this movie. You gotta have false prophets, man, as well, man. And that's yeah. what they set up to, to be, man. All right. So it says through thee we will push down our enemies. Through thy name we will tread them under that rise up against us. For I will not trust in my bow. Neither shall my sword save me. So none of those things, Esau's little toys <laughs> that you trust in, is not gonna save you a damn gun. Because to tell you the truth, those are just toys that Esau eat them. He got way more advanced technology and, and, and sword weaponry that he's gonna bring out on you people in that day, man. Your gun ain't gonna do a damn thing, man. Right. All right. So only thing, see, it's, it, the Lord, Lord got it where. You ain't gonna have no choice but to trust in him. That's your only way out, man. That's your only way out. And the Lord ain't with you. You're through. Exactly. All right. It's coming to that point, man. This man got fucking robots, man. When the robot touch your damn arm, it squeeze and break bones and stuff. Oh yeah, you just you just rip it off. Rip it off, right? Yeah. They showed you that movie. Uh, what was it? Uh, I forget that. The Elder Malcolm wants to, to look at it. What the hell was it? Um, they went to this. Uh, these people living uh, out in the, in, the, in the forest, whatever the hell, and they sent them robots. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forget the name of that damn movie, man. Yeah, it's like somewhere in like, uh, the, the Philippines. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? They sent, it's like, they sent like actual robots to uh, to eliminate targets, you know, for a test, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's what, Esau has that technology, man. You know, go back uh, 30, 40 years, you know, when, they were, it was only known about smartphones, about certain technology, drones. Now, now you can see it today, man. You know, as you know, you saw he holds back his technology and, and uh, pushes it years after, man. That's it. You know? it, says, it says, "For I would not trust in my bow, neither should my sword save me. But Thou hast saved us from our enemies. So you're not gonna save yourself. How about Shimei Al Shai is gonna do that, man? And Lord willing, we part of that elect." That's the only ones he's gonna have mercy on. You know, that's why we do what we do to the best of our ability in hopes that the Lord had mercy, man. You know, so it says, um, uh, why we, you know, doing it, preaching this word, man. You know, in hopes that this is well pleasing to how about Shimmy Al Shot so he can have mercy on us and deliver us from this troubled time that's getting ready to approach this place, man. So it says, um, uh, for thou hast saved us from my enemies, thou hast put them to shame that hated us. And the most high, we, we boast all the day long and praise thy name forever. Pray, praise your name forever. 
There you go, man. So, hey, man, that's the only way you're going to get out of this situ situation that's getting ready to come upon this place. You know, you got people, you know, doomsday preppers storing up food. I believe the Lord, this is why I believe the Lord got them doing that for his elect man, too, man. Right. You know, because... You can store it up all day. You, you know you're not gonna enjoy it. That's gonna be somebody else that you enjoy, man. Hey, to show you that movie, The Road, man. You know, uh, yeah. the, the father and son found some, uh, 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 you know, uh, underground bunker. Un underground bunker full, full, of stuff. full of full of food. Where's the people that 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 uh, set that up, man? They went nowhere around, man. Exactly. You know, so you know that, that's my personal. But we'll see what happens. But you know, I believe the Lord got spear on them. Uh, to, 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 to prepare that food for whoever the elect is, because they, they ain't gonna be a joy. How you? How, how the hell you know when this is? This, this, this is gonna come as thief of the night. How you, you could be far away from your your bunker when this shit crack. You would never be able to get to it. Right. And it's all by design by the Lord. You know, it's yeah. like a, uh, Abraham. Mm -hmm. You know, when he told Lot, "Which way you wanna go?" You know, knowing that he was gonna you know walk towards Israel anyway. You know. Following the Lord, at the end of the day, you're gonna trust in Yahweh by Shimei Yahweh Shai. Yeah. All right, we may not know where we're going, but it's the Lord, uh, you know, directing our steps. You see, and, and it could be like the elder saying to one of those bunkers that are stocked up with food and resources to hold us over for a period of time. You see, but we're coming to the point where again, we're gonna get that power. All right, and our, you know, and our faith is a gift. You know. We could be able, like, uh, to speak to a rock and bring forth a uh, uh, water out of it in the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, or multiply uh, fish and, and bread, because you know we got Isaiah four and one coming. You know all, all the women that that the Lord has for us, uh, Zechariah eight and twenty three. In that day, ten men shall take uh, hold of the skirt of him that is a Jew. So there's gonna be guys. There's gonna be the one third following us, man. All right, in line, in order, and everything, and and the Lord's. He's gonna take care of all of us, man. That's why the scripts say that people should be willing to date that, that power. power we yeah. just were read early, man. All right. That's yeah. it, man. Because you know, within that last hour of grace of salvation, you know, some of the one third, the last ones are gonna uh, wake up, man. Mm -hmm. All right, and they're gonna believe. They're gonna see the power of Yahweh Bashim You know, through His men, and and they're gonna they're gonna know it's the truth, man, and, and drop everything. A lot of dramatic shit is getting ready to come. The Lord, that's that's how the that's how the Lord, that's who the Lord is. Ultimately, he's dramatic power, man. Yeah. You know, and this is going to show. This is him showing his power by, by put bringing all these things that he's going to bring. That's written in scripture, man. You know. So, uh, uh, you got any other scriptures? All right. So, Lord willing, I was edified to hope for righteous elect. Hey, man. Lord willing, we we keep enduring to the end. Hey. Pray, you know, pray that the Lord take not thy Holy Spirit from you, that he give you the strength and ability to endure to the end, man. All right? Because, hey, man, we, we, we need deliverance, man. Brothers going through all types of shit, you know. So, hey, man, we need deliverance from Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Hey, we, we, you know, Lord, Lord willing, we them chosen man. You know, chosen man, starting with the leg, he's going to get that power right back to them. You, you, you two thirds. You'll be straight in the kingdom. All right. When you, whoever you, when you come back through whoever the elect is, you'll be all right, man. All right. Enjoy our people, Lord. And written two thirds should be cough and die, and the, and the elect should be saved, man. So majority of our people, they just, they, it's gonna be destroyed here, but they'll be all right in the kingdom. They're gonna come back through the elect. All right. So with that. Lord, is that fine? Give all praise, honor, and glory to you. How? Yeah, how? Hashem, Yahushai, Hashem, Rakhbadash. That by us, the apostle is a great millstone. And peace, salutations to you, society. I'm pushing this word sincerity, truth, and charity. That we say, Shalom. Shalom. Love above.